Hey people, how are you? So, this has been an extremely tough week for me. I'm not gonna lie, it has not been the best week at all for me, but I am grateful to still be a, I'm still grateful to be able to be here and post a video for you all. Um, right now I'm sitting out in Columbia ready for class. I am probably like an hour early, but I needed some time to just kind of digress from everything, get my mind right so I can be prepared for this class. Really excited about the class. It's about advanced hair loss. So for all of my clients, yes. Um, as you know, I'm always updating my skills on hair, how to better take care of your hair. I really invest a lot of time, a lot of money in doing this. This is my craft, my skill. This is something that I love to do. I really can't see myself doing anything else. Um, so my top things that I love to do is um, spend time outside and I love teaching and I love hair. They're like the best stress relievers for me um, ever. On my downtime, I like to meditate and reflect. So, but I'm not gonna lie. T today, this the last couple of days has not been easy for me at all. Um, I lost my aunt this past week and it's been extremely hard so i'm not going to come on a video today and be like oh yeah i feel really really great and everything is great and you know the world is peachy today the world's not peachy it's cloudy out yesterday was nice and sunny um and that was cool but by the time i got home i was a natural mess i wound up having a total breakdown at my father-in-law's house um that's just how it was but this is the real me and so I'm being really transparent with you all. Um, I will be taking probably about two weeks off work. And I know most of you, when you see this, this will be an old video. So today is March the 11th, 2016. And it's about 10.01. My class doesn't start until 11. But um, yeah, so like I said, I'm taking an advanced hair loss class today. So I'm just here to kind of keep my mind focused, listen to some classical music, um, get into, you know, meditation and just kind of reflecting or more like reflecting. I like to listen to classical music and I reflect. So one of the exercises that I do is that with my daughter is that we'll get in the car and we'll listen to classical music and I'll tell her to close her eyes and visualize what you feel may be going on. Like, how do you feel? And sometimes she's like, oh, I, you know, I can see me and my daddy, you know, we're dancing together. And I'll ask her what kind of dress she has when she says, I have a real long, you know, pretty gown, a white gown, a pink gown, a blue gown, a black gown, whatever color she has, what color shoes, how is her hair. So I ask her all the details. So this is what I do. So this is what I'm getting ready to do is kind of sit here, close my eyes and listen to the classical music and see how it makes me feel. Just a little while ago on my way, um, during my drive to my class, I was, I guess, listening to some hip hop and paying attention to the words, paying attention to the emotions, the feelings that it was giving me. And just like, wow, it's, you know, just the impact on that. So, I don't know, I'm just basically shooting a video because I said I would shoot a video. I know my next video I said I would shoot was going to be based off of women and the salon and the value of the salon so i'm still going to do that probably later on today i got to get my words together and i'll have them together by the end of the day i'm really looking forward to that i want to make sure it's a very um good video for you guys but i haven't done a video in a while and that's one of my reasons why um, besides just my time, you know, I feel really um, encouraged to do a video, but the time doesn't necessarily reflect, oh, I can do a video. I might be driving, then I don't have my piece in the car to do the video while I'm driving, because a lot of times I'm thinking about it as I'm driving. So, and I don't have my piece now, but I said, I'm stop. I'm just here waiting in the parking lot. And I'm going to just take some time out for myself. And I'm going to reflect. 
and be thankful that I'm here. But yes, so this is a sad day for me. Sometimes, you know, I write in my journal and I'll put that, you know, like I'm happy, I'm grateful. All my, um, what do you call them? I am, so I have, so I can't think of the word right now. But I write them down and usually they're very positive and they're very real. But this one, I realize that sometimes I write more for the future instead of for right now. So one of my things that I wrote last night was that I'm sad at the end because I am. But I know tomorrow will be better. One day tomorrow, one tomorrow in the future will be better. But that's just how I feel today. So I know a lot of you think that, oh, you know, Robin, she seems really good. She's really healthy. She thinks really positive and, you know, that's just how you see me. But sometimes I don't think very positive. Sometimes I get really scared and I overthink. Sometimes I have really bad anxiety. And so yeah, that's what it is. So I am, oh, today I had for breakfast, I had cucumbers and apples. <laughs> I sliced up some cucumbers and sprinkled some salt and a little bit of pepper and sliced up some apples. So that's what me and my daughter had yesterday. I mean today, this morning. When I drove to school with cucumbers and apples, keep me hot, help me to be hydrated and have something in my stomach for while I'm taking this class because most likely I probably won't eat anything until about four o'clock this afternoon. Um, so yeah. So I just wanted to, you know, post this quick video on a reel, being very transparent on how I am today and how I've been feeling. I know many people have been looking at my videos and I know they've been informative and I'm glad that I've been able to inform some of you all and like I said before these videos are for me so I can go back and I can look and reflect on my growth in my life so I want to say peace and blessings and I hope you all have a wonderful day and for anybody who's having a sad day, I want you to still try to look for the most positive things even out of your sad day. Or if you're angry or somebody tried to disrupt your energy, take the time out today. Turn on some classical music. I got WBJC. Um, yeah, WBJC 91.5. That's what I listen to. And that's like programmed as number one on my um, programming list for my um, you know my radio station so I just press one and I just go straight into reflection mode so yeah so I'm about to go ahead and do that and I want all of you all to have a good day be thankful that you're able to see another day and even if this is a day that you don't want to see another day or this day, period, go sleep. Just take a nap. But, you know, don't do nothing outrageous. Just take a nap. It's okay. Take a nap. Call off work. Take a nap. Don't do something. Sometimes we just need to rest. Sometimes we're moving around too much. So we need to stop moving. And just rest. Relax. Put some classical music on. Reflect. It'll make you feel good. You think of something positive. You think of something crazy, like good crazy. You know, I don't know. So yeah, that's just me for the day. So normally I don't edit a video, but I might edit this one. I don't know. I might just go ahead and post it on YouTube and then post it on Facebook. All right. See you later. Bye. Enjoy your day.